Joe from Eastern CCTV. Today we're going to go over how to set up IP cameras with our EV series MDR. Today we're going to be working on the 9516 8P. This unit has 8 ports of built in PoE for IP cameras. It also has a LAN port to connect to your network. On top of it, I have an external PoE switch. This PoE switch also has 8 ports of PoE and has 1 gigabit uplink port. First off, I'm going to connect the NDR to the switch. I'm plugging in my Cat5D cable into the LAN port. And then I'm going to connect the other end into my PoE switch that has connection to the internet. Next, we're going to connect the EV series IP camera to the built-in PoE switch. I'm going to connect one end of my Cat5 cable to the jack. Next, I'm going to connect the other end to the built-in PoE on the NVR. Once the EV series camera boots up completely, it will automatically connect to the NVR. Next, we're going to go into the main menu. To go into the main menu, right click, and that'll bring up the toolbar at the bottom. Next, you're going to click on the menu icon on the left hand side. From there, we're going to go into the IP camera option. Here, it'll list the cameras that are connected, the channel that they are on, the manufacturer, the product model, and the status. Next, we're going to go over how to add a third party camera to the ED Series NDR. To add the third party IP camera, we're going to go into Menu. Then we're going to go back into IP Camera. Next, we're going to click on the Add button. The first step is we're going to check Enable. Select the channel. Next, we're going to change the manufacturer from East to OnBit. We're going to enter the IP address. Next, we're going to put the port of the camera. For the port, we're going to select the web port of the camera. In this case, it's 8888. Lastly, we're going to put in the username and password. In this case, the username is admin and the password is admin. Then click OK. And then apply. And here we have a DAFA connected to the EV Series NVR. Previously, we installed a Dahua IP camera onto the ED Series NVR that was connected to the network. Now, I'm going to show you how to connect it to the built in PoE switch. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to open up Config Tool, which is Dahua's tool for scanning for their IP cameras. It'll list how many cameras you have connected to the built in PoE switch. And what we want to do is we want to change the IP address to match the switch IP address on the NVR. To find the switch IP address on the NVR, you have to go into Setup and then Network. Under the Network tab at the very bottom, it'll list the switch IP. In this case, it's 10.151.151.1. So what we're going to do is we're going to put it on the same network. Click on config and modify the IP address. Now that we have the DAPA IP camera configured properly, next on the NVR we're going to go into menu, IP camera. Select the camera that we added, click on setup, next we're going to modify the password. In this case, the password is admin. Press ok, and then apply. This is Joe from Eastern CCTV, and thanks for watching.